Now that we've set the player and platform, we're now going to make the platform loop. Add tiles so that it will overcome the camera. The platform seems to be wiggling. We just need to find zoom values appropriate to the pixel size of the images. Now it's settled. We can now add tile to the platform. Make it so that the platform is just a little wider than the camera. Now to make the platform loop, we need to add a visibility notifier node. We also need to measure the pixel size of the platform. No place the notifier node just before it reaches the camera. Then add the signal screen entered. I made a mistake here. You have to connect the signal to the tile map. Add a script to the tile map and rename it like this. The idea is, we need to know the size of the platform, in this case 480 pixels. And the player is 320 pixels away from the camera. Now when the visibility notifier reaches the region of the camera we will spawn another platform. This is the initial platform. And we will spawn another. This is the camera. And this is the visibility notifier. This is the final product. Take note here that I renamed the, the tile map to platform. I also connected the signal to the tile map script as I showed you earlier. And now we're done for this part. This platform will loop forever.